This is my series on the seven high maintenance things that I do in my garden so that the rest of the year I can have a low maintenance organic garden. In no particular order, number one is beneficial nematodes. Beneficial nematodes are these tiny microscopic worms that burrow into our pests and kill them. So for example, if you deal with squash vine borers in your garden, there is a beneficial nematode for that and they will kill them before they become a problem in your garden. And this video is not an endorsement of any brand, but there's several brands that have these products and they all in my experience have worked really well. This video is going to go over how to properly apply them because they are living organisms so we want to keep them as active and alive as possible. This process starts by mixing them in a sprayer with water that is 60 to 70 degrees Fahrenheit. My favorite time to spray beneficial nematodes is on a cool rainy day. If you don't have a cool rainy day to spray on pick a cool day, water before, spray and then water after and then keep that watered for the next week. Another good time to spray them is just before dark. Just make sure as mentioned before to water them in really well. You want to get them rinsed into the soil where they're nice and safe. And notice that I'm not spraying them on the leaves of the plants. I'm spraying them around into the soil. That's where they're going to live and seek out the pest larva so that they can kill them. And what's amazing it only takes them about seven to ten days in order to kill the pests. So they work really fast and really well. The new toads also prevent pests for fruit trees so I spray them in my food forest and orchards as well where they prevent things like Japanese beetles and leaf miners. Follow along for parts two through seven on the high maintenance things I do once per season so that the rest of the season my garden is low maintenance and organic. 